Hello, I'm Andy and I'm going to read to you weekly horoscopes from February the 19th to the 28th of February for you coming from Gemini. So let's go on with Sunday the 19th. That's a not a very good start. It shows you're very sensitive to any kind of approach to you, showing a lot of arrogance and not wanting to do any teamwork with anybody, showing the way that you communicate is also in a very arrogant and stubborn way. If you continue to do that on Sunday the 19th, the morning, afternoon and earlier period will be turning very bad for you. During the evening from about 6.30 to 7pm onwards until midnight, a small group of better planets move in and they bring about a lot of luck which comes unexpectedly and suddenly. So you may also find solutions during the late evening or the night session about uh, the problems of the earlier day. And so good to socialize, good to do some bonding during the evening and night session for Sunday the 19th. Monday the 20th uh, shows again the morning and afternoon session as unsureness. Your lack of direction forward, your emotional area taking over too much and not allowing your common sense to work. And also feeling very restless and emotionally you are a little bit under pressure. This is for morning and afternoon session. Evening session and night session turns very good from a, a bit early from 6 p.m. onwards. You become luckier and luckier. Good news comes in where earlier it didn't. And if you are out socializing with your colleagues or business people or with your romance partner or marriage, it's good to do that in the evening, the late evening and the night session where you get very lucky. Tuesday the 21st and that's a really difficult start now. It's a time where on Tuesday the 21st you find opposition coming to you very strongly and difficulties approaching very difficult in a very difficult manner. Your bosses in your career or your colleagues, business partnerships or those you do business with are also wide open for trouble. And in romance and marriage, don't say the wrong thing or don't do the wrong thing. Take the soft approach to help yourself. The evening session improves a lot from about 6 p.m. to 6.30 p.m. onwards. Good news comes to come in. You may be able to find solutions which you could not find earlier. And thereby, you will improve the 21st of Tuesday uh, into a much, much, much better ending. Wednesday the 22nd starts beautifully for you. You get unexpected good news, you get unexpected luck in every way, you get unexpected uh, communication, uh, so you are a very happy person in the morning, afternoon and early evening session. You will do well in career, you will do well in business, in romance and marriage. The evening session, watch out. That there's two kinds of warning. One is that disappointment awaits you from about 6.30 p.m. onwards. Also bad news can come in. So disappointment and bad news, a danger of accidents can also be seen. So some kind of a mishap can also be seen. Now these negative planets are also seen during the day and afternoon period. So watch out that little bits of trouble may also seek in. Although I find your morning and afternoon session very good. So evening session, don't take any risks. Try to play safe. Thursday the 23rd is an excellent day for you, morning, noon and night. You have planets which bring good news, which help you in areas of communication, which make you basically very lucky in areas of romance, marriage, in areas of uh, career and business. So project yourself. Communicate with people you want to. You'll find that good news comes in very nicely. The evening and night session is also good. It produces long-term uh, bonding, long-term friendliness, long-term romance. So things of a long-term nature are very stable in your night, in your evening and night session, making the whole day of Thursday the 23rd very good for you. Friday the 24th, another excellent day. Morning and afternoon and early evening periods are very good. They bring a lot of luck in career, business, romance or marriage. They basically bring the possibility of you doing well in anything you do. The evening session, watch out. There are aggressive planets there. So the, from about 6.30 to 7 p.m. onwards up to midnight, take the soft approach. You cannot afford to be provocative. You cannot afford to use words which are not good. You cannot afford to, to get into any kind of a hostile argument. Otherwise, you will spoil the whole day because the evening can turn very bad. Or you can improve it by taking the soft approach. 
Saturday the 25th is a very difficult beginning for you. The morning-afternoon period shows opposition, difficulties, danger of accidents, being let down, being played out even, being disappointed. Now all these things are in the air. You have to analyze them in a positive way. That way you can improve your Saturday the 25th. The evening session shows you are very sensitive to criticism, you isolate yourself, you tend to be very arrogant in your approach. So don't do that. Try to stay, stay humble. And that way, even the evening and night session of Saturday the 25th can be improved. Sunday the 26th, a much better beginning. There is more calmness. There shows, uh, it makes you very compassionate, by the way, uh, the morning and afternoon session and evening too. And very emotional as well. So you become a nice person to approach to, to deal with things in career business if you are working on a Sunday or even in your area of romance and marriage. Morning, afternoon, early evening sessions, very good. The evening session has a cluster of emotional planets and there tends to be a changeability about you. Wanting to change plans, wanting to change your, what you, your desires are and the moodiness can creep in. So try to control the evening session by not being, by not being too moody and that way you can improve it. Monday the 27th, it starts off in a very fiery way. There will be plenty for you to say which other people don't want to hear. So you'd rather not say it. Take the soft approach in everything that you say or do. And don't be aggressive. Otherwise, your morning and afternoon sessions are going to be with many ups and downs. Your evening session also does not do very well. And from about 6.30 or 6 p.m. onwards, again, the planets who trouble you, bring disappointments, bring opposition, bring bad news, they can be seen in the evening night session. So don't drink too much, don't stay on uh, too late in the night, or mishaps can take place as well. Tuesday the 28th starts not well. It produces a person who is very oversensitive to criticism, who gets news that doesn't make you happy, and it makes you isolated that way. Try to be the opposite. Uh, listen to advice. Go along with the plans of others. Take things in your stride. It cannot be all that bad. The evening session from about 6 p.m. onwards improves a lot. So evening and night session brings a lot of help for you. And this help includes finding solutions which you could not find in the daytime. And so uh, that's what your Tuesday the 28th. And that's what I have to tell you for this long week, Sunday the 19th up to Tuesday the 28th. Do go to Facebook and follow me, communicate with me. I'm already Skyping and I can do a 75-minute session with you uh, based on your full date of birth and time of birth and looking at your palms. I'll be able to do a full horoscope for you on Skype. It will cost you USD 50, 5 zero. Um, and uh, we'll be able to answer all your questions. Until then, all the best of luck for you. Thank you and goodbye.